हेलो फ्रेंड्स मैसेल प्रोफेसर एस पी मंकनी असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ मेकैनिकल इंजीनियरिंग वालचंद इंस्टिट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी सोलापुर टुडे वर गोइंग टू स्टडी प्रोजेक्शन ऑफ प्रोफाइल लाइंस एट द एंड ऑफ दिस लेक्चर स्टूडेंट्स विल बी एबल टू ड्रॉ द प्रोजेक्शन ऑफ गिवन प्रोफाइल लाइन सो हियर इज द क्वेश्चन ए लाइन ए बी सेवेंटी फाइव मिलीमीटर लॉन्ग हैज वन एंड ए इन वी पी अदर एंड बी is 15 mm above hp and 50 mm in front of vp draw the projection of the line when sum of its inclination with hp and vp is 90 degree means it is lying in profile plane find true angles with reference planes and its traces so here the the important thing is here the inclination with hp and vp is given 90 degree means it is lying in a profile plane even if the uh, this particular wordings are not given also you consider that the summation of those two angles are 90 degree means you have to go with the profile plane only so the given line is 75 mm length so initially we are going to be set up in the uh, given conditions here just you draw the xy line so then you just draw the vertical line as a uh, to locate the points as as per the given condition so this is the point is given as in the vertical plane in the vertical plane we are given this point as a a point here this point is given as a a point this point is situated in the vertical plane so this another position you have taken as a front view point it is a b dash point you have taken it so the situation of this one he has given it as a 15 mm above and this point he has given as a 50 mm here ha huh? below the Uh, x y line you are going to be taken as a 50 mm this is all the given condition just you are going to be locating this given condition so here this is a vertical reference plane and this is a horizontal reference plane vertical reference plane and this is a horizontal reference plane these are the reference plane so as if we are going to be considering this as a side view it is nothing but a side view if you look the one of my previous uh, lecture you will find it as a these are actually a plane so plane like this and this one is plane like this so that is what you are going to be observing from the left hand side you are going to be drawing on the right hand side of the figure so if you observe this one you are going to get this as a single line and this also as a single line just you have located the position of this b point he has given in the problem and this a point is situated on the vertical plane it is touching the xy line below the xy line and this b position also given in the problem as 50 mm uh, in front of the vertical plane so now we have to bring it this projector on the this particular profile lines so i brought it this one b point here the projector line like this so means you bring it up to this particular line where the intersection line is there keep the compass here take it this much as a dimension draw the arc so it will cut this horizontal reference plane this horizontal reference plane so here the intersecting point and if you bring it this particular point it is going to intersect at this particular point so now we are going to be locating this as a b double dash point all front view has to be naming with the dash mark and top view without dash mark and the side you are going to be taken as a profile line as a with a double dash mark as a just it is for the reference purpose even you can give the another notation also so this is a intersection point as a double b dash so here in the problem he has given as a summation of theta as well as phi angle summation of theta as well as phi angle theta is the angle made by the line with the horizontal reference plane and angle made by the line with the vertical reference plane the summation of these two angles he has given as a 90 degree so this particular uh, type of the problems fall in this particular group as the summation of the angle of uh, the horizontal plane angle with the horizontal plane angle with the vertical plane if it comes as a 90 degree then you are going to be following this particular method as a profile uh, method so here this particularly theta and phi is a given in the problem as a 90 degree that's why you have taken this particular line and this is this length is he has given in the problem as 75 mm so 75 mm this length is 75 mm here constant if you move in the upward direction the length is goes on increasing if you come in the downward direction the length is comes in the decreasing fashion now it is 75 mm you have taken this as a 75 mm length so now you have to consider this one as so here so just it is a just you can go it back so here is given as a one more word as uh, the traces find the true 
angles with the reference planes and its traces and its traces he has given we should think it this particular as a in my separate lecture uh, about the traces this particular traces are concerned okay so now we have to study up to this particular point i will explain this particular part also okay up to the point where we are stopped here so now you are given the namings here okay so now we can start it up to this particular as a a dash a double dash b double dash is a true length this is a true length and this angle this angle and this angle is 90 degree angle so here we are going to be writing this as a vertical trace and here we are going to be writing this as a horizontal trace just i will give a small information about this one as if the line you are going to be extended and it going to touch the horizontal reference plane you are going to be calling that as a horizontal trace and if it touches the vertical reference plane you are going to be calling this as a vertical traces so the detail we are going to be studying in the separate lecture so you bring it this point in the same point in the downward direction as you are flowing for this particular point you can come back to the same condition in the backwards so now you projected this point this coming as a a dash a dash b dash is the front view of the given line a dash b dash is the front view of the given line this is a given line the true length this is a true length this line is a true length and this is a front view length so and this point if you are going to bring it back and it is going to touch this particular line extension of this particular line it is a extension of this particular line but it is touching on the same point that is the reason you are going to call this as a vertical trace here only you need not to bother about the detail part of this one so now you bring it this point like this then it is going to touch it here and this is a horizontal trace is concerned this is a horizontal plane and this is a vertical plane and here it is a front view and this one is a top view and here you can write it as this is a true length this is a true length and we are going to call this as a side view so here this line this line and this lines are a dark lines and rest of this projector should be drawn as a thin line here this project projection line also you are going to write as a thin line the important part is you have drawn this particular figure on the right hand side of the figure why you are going to draw it on the right hand side why not you can draw it on this side also so as far as the lines are concerned the same thing you can take it this side also same thing you can take it on this side also only thing is so this is coming as a left hand side view you are going to be drawing it on the right hand side of the figure is concerned if you are going to draw it this side it is coming as a right hand side view so that time this figure is a reverse of this one only nothing uh, more than this one the same figure you are going to get it this side also it is a mirror image of this one you are going to get it this line it will come like this that time rest of all the informations are exactly similar okay this is theta angle this one is phi angle okay so here this concludes the problem on the profile plane is concerned so if you are having uh, this particular type of the problems specially when there is a summation of the angle is 90 degree summation of the angle is 90 degree that time you are expected to follow this particular procedure is concerned so now we have to come back to the original given condition he has given the uh, conditions just you have to verify all the conditions are satisfied or is there any condition is remaining the summation of the angle is 90 degree that is the reason you have gone for this particular procedure and he has given the position of a is in the vertical reference plane so that is the reason you have taken this particular point is here only vertical reference plane and this particular as a distance given as a 15 mm you have taken as a above the xy line is 15 mm then you have located this particular point and this length he has given as a 50 mm you have taken this up to this one as a 50 mm so means all the given conditions are satisfied we are going to be comparing uh, this particularly a 3d dimensional a uh, three dimensional figure and as well as a two dimensional figure whatever you are drawn here so just you can observe it this particular red color line true length line is available with the profile plane here so this is a profile plane line here so this is a vertical plane and this is a horizontal plane if you are going to observe this particularly in this direction that is a left hand side view if you are going to observe this one this particular line and this particular line and this junction is a xy line so now you can observe this line and this line here 
So this is a vertical reference plane and this is a horizontal reference plane. And here this particular angle is the angle made by the line with the horizontal reference plane that is a theta angle. So that is what you are representing here as a theta angle here. And this is the angle made by the line with the vertical reference plane. This angle we are going to be calling this as a this particular angle. So this angle we are going to write it here as this is a phi angle. So means this is a vertical reference plane and this is a horizontal reference plane. This is a vertical reference plane and horizontal reference plane. You are going to observe in this direction and you are going to draw this particularly these two lines. So here these two lines are vertical reference plane and horizontal reference plane. And this is a profile plane. So this profile plane is this particularly as a profile plane here. So if you are going to open it this one in this particular direction means you are going to be opening this particularly plane in this direction. So that time you are going to get it this particularly a green color plate here. So on this one you are going to get it this image means you are going to be observing from the left hand side. You are going to observe from the left hand side and that particular image is coming here. So that is what this particular figure here. So you are going to draw this diagram as a on this particular as a green plate. It is nothing but a profile plane. So one of my this particularly as a question previously I put as if the plate is available here. So then you are going to draw this as a left hand side view as if nothing but you are going to tilt this plate in this direction you will get it this as a image. If the plate is available at this particularly here and the image is this particular line is backside of this plate. So that time you are going to be tilting this particularly plate in this direction. If you are, you are going to be tilting this uh, plate in this direction. So that time you will get it this same image on this side here only with the reverse direction. Thank you.